Hey guys, so this, I'm not doing this to show off, okay? So I'm just showing you like the money you can make in the mortgage industry or real estate industry. There's a lot of money to be made here. And I wanna show you just, and I'm not gonna put my face on it because I wanna show you like with facts. If you're maybe considering, should I stay, should I not? Do I wanna join uh, a different company, a different leadership, a different team? Look, these are all recent checks. We've never, never had the bank accounts, total bank accounts, because there's money in a lot of different accounts, stacked. There's money hidden, there's money away, there's money overseas, there's money all over the place. And investments that, you know, I don't talk about a lot. But these are the, the small checks you could get, you know, if, if you work in the mortgage industry or real estate industry. And these are checks that we got into the point where you know we hold off to a lot of checks we don't even deposit them we just wait and then we just put them all in because it's money on autopilot money on autopilot it's a saturday i'm here at the office and it's just check after check after check and it's the same it takes the same amount of work to make the little check as it does to make the big check. We had a huge party yesterday with a lot of top performers, you know, and people are making a lot of money uh, with each transaction. This is all money in the bank, guys. Like, I mean, 25K, 30K, you know, there's a lot of money to be made. And I wanna show you something really special. We had a party yesterday, so there's like empty bottles here, people measuring their body fat, you got this view. Hold up, I'll, I'll save the view for 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 after. Okay, got some for Agamo right there. It's a little messy. We had a party yesterday, so excuse that. But look, if you are in a small broker shop or in the wrong leadership, and maybe you're having second thoughts, remember all of this takes a lot of money. This. We have the entire floor. It's a hundred grand a month. Okay, more or less a hundred grand a month that it takes for this space. You got the proper conference room with nice view. Once again, we had a nice party. We, we got a we we own the floor so nobody can come up here. We have the the ladies uh, restroom right there. We have the men's restroom right there. We had a bar right there. We have those nice little driven letters. Look, Right now is the time to be with a broker company that's big, that has a lot of resources, that's gonna be able to weather the storm, whether the rates go up, whether we have the gym here for our people, whether the rates go up, whether prices go down, whether we have a recession, you know, you gotta be ready for that. You gotta have a lot of resources. And I've busted my ass here with all my people to provide all of this for you guys, to provide you a nice big office, entire floor. See, we got some new printers right there. Not too long ago, I got declined because I didn't qualify for printers. Funny, huh? Funny story. But you know what? I got grit. Grit. You can't buy grit. For all my Latinos, that's called huevos. You need huevos, you need some fucking balls, all right? Tom Bilyeu's house over there. We got our kitchen coming along. We still need a, a bit of uh, furniture that's on its way, but for now, we're not stopping. We're using our existing furniture. We got another, this is the ambiance side. Ambiance Realty, TV's up. It's gonna be the podcast studio. That's right. It's own elevator. You can't come up here if you don't belong here. Look at how big it is. Open space. You could run sprints. You could run a marathon in here. See, that's our, uh, our real estate uh, badass uh, girls that we have right there. Liz and Claudia. We have our own restroom for the men, restroom for the women. And just in case you want to make some calls, this is going to be our call center with some phone booths. You want to take a shower? No problem. 
No problem. Take a shower. Take a shower. Locker room. You want some keels? You want a view? You want to take a shower? More restrooms. So this is how we do it here. Like I said, it's not about me, but this just shows you, right? Not showing off, but this watch is worth half a million dollars and you can finance this just in case you're watching. It is a real watch and you can finance this. You can finance that. Oh, that's my car too. Oh, I used to live there. That used to be my office. All right, so what I'm doing right now is I'm showing you how, you know, somebody that came from nothing, little Mexican kid, people made fun of, my accent, this, that, this, that. When you have balls, you can create a lot of things for your people. Because all, we all went together. We all went together. And there's a lot of people, you know, that get jealous, have envy, and then they become haters. And then guess what? The haters like to hang out with the haters. The losers like to hang out with the losers. Toxic people like to be around toxic people because that's all they talk about, toxic shit. So if you're taking advice or you're getting brainwashed by a toxic little bitch, then get rid of the bitch and join the winner's club because we ain't going anywhere. Like I said, we are fucking stacked with resources, relationships, and we don't burn our bridges. So if you wanna come by, you wanna join the mortgage guys, if you're, if you wanna stay with TMG, you wanna stay with TMG, maybe you're getting influenced, brainwashed by a certain guy or a certain girl, and you wanna join the winner's club here up in the clouds. Not too long ago, guys, I used to be there. About eight years ago, I used to go there and I used to have a nice little margarita right there at Le Petit Four. And I used to dream one day I'll be on Sunset Plaza. One day I'll live here. One day I'll work here. One day I'll have a, an office here. That used to be my gym over there. Okay, Equinox. And I said, one day, one day, one day. And guess what? Today's the day. So if you guys are, you know, in a little shop, a little leader, getting brainwashed hey that you know that person's probably gonna go out of business pretty soon that person probably burned his bridges that girl probably burned her bridges so maybe stay away and watch the source of your advice good things happen to good people and can't wait can't wait till you guys just we all went together and we blow the fuck up lfg that's right let's go